today we will learn about some common misconceptions and mistakes related to multiplication of fractions misconception 1 which of the following statements represents the shaded part of the given picture as a multiplication statement children often try to learn multiplication of fractions by rote they are unable to understand its concept this is why the shaded portion of the given picture is expressed incorrectly as multiplication as some children think that there are four shaded parts in each rectangle so the shaded portion of three rectangles can be detected by this multiplication 3 into 4 so they would choose option 1 as the correct answer however this is wrong the correct understanding is that 4/6 part is repeated 3 times therefore while multiplying we will write 3 into 4 by 6 hence the correct answer is option 2 it is important to note that there are three complete figures for each of which 4/6 part has been taken therefore we can also express it as 4 by 6 into 3 misconception 2 nisha bought 3/4 kg potatoes out of this she used 3/5 portion to cook vegetables find out how many kgs of potatoes have been used here nisha has used 3/5 of 3/4 kg of potatoes to cook to find out how many kgs of potatoes have been used we have to find out how much is 3/5 of 3/4 kg for this we have to find the product 3 by 5 into 3 by 4 for this we multiply the numerators and get the numerator of the result as 9 similarly we multiply denominators and get the denominator of the result as 20 therefore the correct result is 9 by 20 kg that is option 2 is the correct answer to the question some children are unable to understand the question given they believe that in order to find out how many kilos of potatoes did nisha cook they have to subtract 3/5 from 3/4 as a result they get the wrong answer now let us look at some common mistakes made during multiplication of fractions when children are asked to find the product of any two fractions such as 2 by 3 and 3 by 4 Some children multiply the numerator of the first fraction by the denominator of the second fraction and the numerator of the second fraction by the denominator of the first fraction then they add them this is wrong the correct method is that the numerator of the result is the product of the numerators of the given fractions and the denominator of the result is the product of the denominators of the given fractions therefore the correct answer is 6 by 12 which can also be expressed in the simplest form as 1 by 2 some children use fractions incorrectly as operator of for example if they are asked what will be 2/3 of 6 then they try to subtract 2/3 from 6 this is a misconception it is important to understand that whenever we use the operator of it means we have to multiply hence here we do 2 by 3 into 6 which will result in 4 if the denominators of the two fractions are not equal during multiplication then some children try to make them equal this is a misconception to multiply two fractions the numerators and the denominators are separately multiplied and written in place of the numerator and the denominator of the result today we've learned some common misconceptions and mistakes related to multiplication of fractions